To answer the first question, it's important to know that both the Pfizer and Moderna vaccines are mRNA vaccines. mRNA, which is also known as a messenger RNA, is a piece of genetic material that contains instructions for your cells, telling them how to build proteins. In the case of mRNA vaccines, the vaccine contains mRNA, and it gives your cells instructions to build a spike protein that resembles the spike protein on the surface of the coronavirus. Your body presents this protein on the surface of the cell. Then, your body recognizes the spike protein and creates an immune response against it. If your body ever encounters the spike protein again, like if you were to be exposed to the COVID-19 virus, your body would have an immune response ready to act. So now that you know a little bit more about how mRNA vaccines work, we can address the question of, can the COVID-19 vaccines change my DNA? The concern may come from the fact that genetic material is inserted into your body and that it could somehow mix with your own genetic material and change it. But I'm here to tell you that that is not possible. First, the mRNA cannot get into your cell's nucleus and the nucleus is, well, is where the cell's DNA is located. Further, even if it could get into the nucleus, it's a strand of RNA, which is not DNA. These are different genetic languages and your cells and the vaccine are not able to change it from a strand of RNA to DNA, and then to further cause the RNA to combine with the DNA. It is simply not possible. Finally, it's important to know that mRNA is not a stable molecule for long. After your body reads the mRNA and the spike protein is made, the cell breaks down the mRNA from the vaccine within hours. Mm -hmm.